Home to ancient cultures long before the Spanish reached its shores, Lima blends the past with the present, making it an inviting city to visit. Peru's capital and largest city is the place to learn more about pre-Columbian life, at a time when humans were sacrificed to appease the gods. The city is filled with museums, some on colonial buildings, others in modern buildings. Visitors who desire a break from antiquities can enjoy a stroll along the beach, or chow down on typical Peruvian food at a neighborhood cafe. And when night falls, visitors can partake of the disco scene or enjoy a magic show, featuring dancing water fountains. Number 1. Miraflores District. Miraflores is one of Lima's more exclusive neighborhoods, and definitely one of its most scenic, since it sits on a bluff overlooking the Pacific Ocean. It is the beach resort and entertainment center in Lima. The beach is very popular with surfers and paragliders. Miraflores oozes with upscale shopping opportunities, but travelers interested in Peruvian arts and crafts will head to Avenue Petitoire. Number 2. Plaza de Armas. The Plaza de Armas is where the city of Lima was born. Also known as the Plaza Mayor, it is the heart of the city, located in its historic district, with streets radiating out in a grid. The location was picked by the Spanish conquistador Francisco Pizarro in 1535. Though not one original building remains, at the center of the plaza is an impressive bronze fountain erected in 1650. Today the plaza is flanked by a cathedral and several palaces. Number 3. Magic Water Tour. The Parque de la Reserva is a lovely park by day, but transforms itself into a spectacular water, sound and light show at night. The park's 13 fountains are turned off during the day, but spring to life at night at this family-oriented tourist attraction in Lima. Visitors who stroll the Magic Water Tour are awed by the fantastic displays that transform ordinary fountains into wondrous eruptions when combined with laser lights and music. Number 4. Museo Laco. The Museo Laco is a must-see for travelers interested in pre-Columbian art. The private museum, founded by Rafael Laco Herrera, is located in an 18th-century building, that was built over a 7th-century pyramid. The museum's collections, representing 5,000 years of Peruvian history, are arranged chronologically. The museum's total collection numbers thousands of pieces. Number 5. Convento de San Francisco. The Monastery of San Francisco, which dates back to 1673, when it was consecrated, is famous for its Spanish Baroque architecture. This graceful, stately complex is a landmark in historic Lima. It honors Jude the Apostle, on his feast day, 40 people carry about a silver stand weighing 1.5 tons. The monastery is famous for its library, including a Bible printed in 1571. The monastery is just as famous for catacombs. Number 6. Waka Puklana. If ancient monuments appeal to travelers, then Waka Puklana is the place to go, it's considered one of Lima's most important monuments. Located in Miraflores, this adobe pyramid was built around 500, but was later covered up and not rediscovered until the mid-20th century. Based on their excavations, Archaeologists believe Waka Puklana was the ceremonial and administrative center for the early Lima culture. Number 7. Casa Oliaga. Safely hidden in a side street is Casa Oliaga, one of the lesser known attractions in Lima. As old as Lima itself, the house stands on land given in 1535 to Hieronimo de Oliaga, one of Pizarro's followers, and which has been occupied by 18 generations of his descendants. Casa Oliaga may not look like much from the outside, but the interiors are lovely, with vintage furnishings and tile work. Number 8. Barranco District. Centuries ago, Barranco was a sleepy fishing village. Now it is a coastal district that once was the playground for wealthy Lemans. In the 20th century, 
However, writers and artists began moving in, giving the district a bohemian flavor. This picturesque district is dotted with brightly painted art deco houses, accented with blossoming trees. Comes alive when the sun goes down. Number 9. Lima Cathedral. Groundbreaking for the construction of the original Lima Cathedral took place in 1535, and was expanded over the years. After it was destroyed several times by earthquakes, it was demolished and a totally new cathedral built several centuries later. The current cathedral is based on the 1746 cathedral. With additions over the years, the cathedral represents architectural styles from Baroque to Neoclassic. Number 10. Torrey Tegel Palace. The Torrey Tegel Palace is a stately looking building, that blends several architectural styles in downtown Lima. The building blends Moorish, Andalusian, Asian and Criollo features, with even some materials coming from Spain. Two dark wood balconies grace the front of this Spanish Baroque building, while the interior features high ceilings and civilian tiles. Lima is a vibrant and dynamic city that offers an abundance of cultural, culinary, and historical experiences for tourists. From exploring the stunning colonial architecture in the city center, to indulging in the world-renowned Peruvian cuisine, there is something for everyone in Lima. With its warm climate, friendly locals, and diverse range of attractions, Lima is the perfect destination for travelers looking to immerse themselves in the rich culture and history of South America. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.